Hello friends, welcome to part 41 of my Horizon Zero Dawn full blind playthrough on the PlayStation 5. We're on ultra hard difficulty and I'm hiding. <laughs> hiding from these godforsaken glint hawks. Um, okay, I've just reloaded the save and we just finished the Grave Horde quest. And guys, what a, what a journey. Honestly, what a journey this has been. It's been crazy very um how can i say very tragic you know when you listen to all of the um voice recordings left from you know dead soldiers and you know so a titanic battle that happened here but hey listen the humans did take down this um horus and um you know they fought bravely but ultimately it was not enough and uh, guys, we still don't know what the hell Horizon Zero Dawn actually is, or Zero Dawn. So I don't know what that project is about. I've got a suspicion though, but I'm not sure if I'm correct or not. But um, I'm actually thinking it was an AI that was created to destroy the machines. That's why most of these mach old machines are dead and buried. Because look, how come, wait, how come um, life continued because if you remember one of the um data points we found actually said you know what guys <laughs> let me just let me just hide somewhere give me a sec oh shit oh god <laughs> oh you piece of crap oh my god i don't believe this guys oh no go away my god all right they're still chasing me I'm gonna get you. Don't you worry about that, you piece of shit. <laughs> what a shot. Okay, anyway. Anywho, just give me a sec, guys. Uh, guys, I figured out how this um, Silent Hunter works. The outfit I'm wearing, I mean. Basically, they lose aggro quicker. Oh, crap. Oh, god damn it. <laughs> she didn't even know I was here. <laughs> All right, one sec, one second, one second. Oh, you mofo. Oh, don't worry, you're dead. You're dead too. He missed. The piece of shit missed. Sucker. <laughs> anyway, guys, what I was trying to say, I'll just wrap this up real quick. There was a data point that we found, and it was saying how apparently the atmosphere was um, getting destroyed as well. The machines were destroying everything, even molecular life. And that is just crazy to me, guys. So anyway, if that was the case, why would there be life now? Do you see what I mean? So Horizon Zero... Sorry, Horizon. Zero Dawn. Project Zero Dawn did work. So that's what I'm thinking. Anyway, guys, what we're going to do moving forwards, the next few episodes are actually going to be, you know, side stuff. We're going to do a lot of side quests, errands. Uh, I'm going to do some exploring as well, collecting collectibles and um i'd very much like to do some of these hunting grounds i know there's one here and there's also one up north somewhere like this one we're gonna do a couple of tall necks you get the picture so i would like to do some side quests and then we're gonna do uh the other main quests that we were tasked to do oh and look there's also a cauldron here as well so um yeah this this whole week will probably be just you know side stuff Anyway, so what we're going to do today is this one, not this one, not, no, 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 one sec. This one here, a moment's peace, because we're right next to where the Grave Horde was. So we're going to do that, and, oh, and I need to show you something, sorry. Check this out. Now, I've now co uh, completed this entire forager tree, except for this. What is that, Scavenger Plus? I don't know, I'll get it some other time. But um, I didn't really care about overriding machines um indefinitely i do really care about that it was actually this one here call mount i can call a mount anytime so check this out guys how does this work <laughs> that is awesome man all right excellent all right let's just heal up real quick so how do we get to this place oh crap i have to go through where the glint hawks, uh, glint hawks were right give me a sec all right here we go guys Anyway, hope everyone's doing well. Hope you guys are enjoying the play uh, playthrough. Are we going the right way? No, we're not. It's... Oh, 
guys. <laughs> guys, just ignore me. It's actually down here. God damn it. But I really like the uh, setting here. It's really beautiful, you know. Anyway, all right. Let's keep going. Hey, guys. Okay, I thought I'd show you this. Um, again, because we're very close to where this, you know, massive battle happened between the machines and, you know, the soldiers um, in the robot command. There's a ton of tanks here. Back to your business. I just uh, thought I'd show you guys, but it's just fascinating to me. Anyway, let's keep going. Oh shit, Clint Hawks. <laughs> Get out of it. Go, go, go. <laughs> I'm not in the mood. I don't want to fight them. I can't stand those things. Oh, you're kidding, guys. You are actually kidding me. Um, all right, we're nearly there. Let's just keep going. We're nearly there. Are these friends? All right, guys, let's let's take them on. It's fine. We got friends as well, so we're good. See you up there. Oh, you piece of shit! <laughs> right there we go. I also increased some of my arrow capacity as well. Oh, keep steady, piece of shit. <laughs> no, leave my mount alone. My mount killed it. <laughs> awesome. <laughs> oh, thank you, mount. That's brilliant. <laughs> all right, these look like friends, so that's good. <laughs> Guys, all right, awesome. Okay, so how far away is this? All right, anyway, let me read out the actual quest. We're more or less there now, so... Okay, it's a side quest called A Moment's Peace. A remote Banuk camp is surrounded by docile machines. What could be causing their strange behaviour? Search for the Banuk camp, 3000 XP, and we get an extraordinary reward box. Awesome. Okay, let's go. What the... Guys, Brandley Machine. Wait, hold on. Have these people? This has to be the Benuk camp. The Vilgen told. Sorry, I didn't select it. Yet. I'm sorry, guys. So what happened to the other mercenaries he sent? The machines are docile. It's like they've already been overridden. Right, that's what I was saying, guys. So this tribe has um, learned how to override machines. <laughs> That's insane, guys. Can I talk to him? Alright, it won't give me an option to talk to him. Guys, a friendly scrapper. Are you kidding me? Hey, wait, what's that? Was she exiled to wander? There, a signal. And the source is at the top of the mountain. I'd better look into it. Alright. Okay, not yet. Let's um look around first. Hey, Scrapper, are you my friend? The spoils of the hunt have been a little light lately. We should find a few machines, earn the spirit's favor. Okay, whatever you say. <laughs> All right, guys. This is insane. What's that? A friendly ravager. I mean, obviously I can override them, but it's just unusual seeing that this has been done as well by others. Right, Banuk encampment. <laughs> this is crazy. Wow. Um, I don't actually know what to do. Search for a path up the mountain. Okay, fine. All right, let's do that first. Whoops. Interesting. I'll tell you what, let's do a quick scan. All right, I look, it looks like there's main characters here, so we'll tick hook and some two other people. So let's do that. Let me do some looting as well. Uh, I've already bought stuff. I'm, I'm good. Okay. 
<laughs> That's insane, guys. All right, supply box here. What a nice village. Let me save it real quick. I am the best hunter of my world, and none shall wrest that honor from me. <laughs> All right, someone's a bit arrogant. All right, let's talk to this person. I don't know. To see these machines up close like this, it's grazer dung. I'm sorry? Frozen grazer dung. This ravager led me here. <laughs> I chased it down from the rivals, where it killed a great ice hunter. Tore him in two. The challenge I accepted. But when it reached this camp, the fury left it. Isn't that a good thing? Takuk says it's a gift. Pfft. What is a gift but a reward that you didn't earn? The machines are meant to challenge us. Now I'm stuck here guarding the shamans. The last hunt was a good one. Struck swift as That's well. insane, guys. However, whatever this is, I think is probably what's causing these machines to be friendly, perhaps. I don't know. It's just a theory. I don't know if I'm right or not. However, there's someone else to talk. Right, this one. Greetings, Nora. I am Tikuk. Shaman. I've never seen anything like this. <laughs> The blue light is strong here. My people traveled far from the heights of Ban Ur to experience it for themselves. The blue light? The light of the machine spirits. It is all around us. It settles upon us. This is how it used to be before they grew angry. I, I know about the derangement, but I didn't think the machines were ever this calm. What is it about this place? We don't really know. We sing and we listen to the machine songs. Teacook, have any other outlanders come through here recently? Some Asaram, yes. They were convinced the machines were malfunctioning, as if machines were mere devices in need of repair. Well, that is how the Asaram see the world, is it not? They ate with us. Then, when they were satisfied there was nothing they could explain, they left with the Northern Light. The machines sing to you? To each other. You are a hunter. You must have heard. Their communions and hymns, their calls and cries. We're not meant to understand, but we shamans try to interpret. What is the song? that angered them so, that turned them upon us. What song soothes them? Does it thrum in the air here, just outside of hearing? How can we heal the machine world? The Thunder Jaw. What's with the big guy? I was drawn to this place in a storm. At first, I thought the keening was the wind snapping off the mountain's frozen face. But no, it was the Thunderjaw's song. I found it crouched on its haunches, its metal unmoving, and I took shelter beneath it. When the storm cleared, its singing done, perhaps the spirit left its great shell, or perhaps it slumbers and remains. So we have not stripped and gleaned this one, we treat it with the care it is owed. That's interesting. Okay, I'll investigate. Do you mind if I look around more, Tikuk? Speak, trade, listen. You are welcome. No harm will come to you here. So it's not the Banuk that are doing this. There's something about this place. They can't see it, but maybe my focus can. Wow, what a bunch of nice people. <laughs> what a nice place. All right, let's see. We've spoken to her. There was, I swear there was someone else. All right, there you go. Okay, any more supply? Well, there's a lot of supply boxes here. All right, let's grab all of this while we have an opportunity to. Find a few machines. Only 
Oh, well, by the way, where's the thunder? Oh, there's the thunder jewel. Jesus, right in front of me. God damn it. So it looks like it's dead. Okay. Anyway. All right, guys. I just looted everything I could find. Um, let's speak to this dude here. What's up, buddy? Shaman. You're trying to understand the machines here, too? Yes, Nora. And taking my time with my studies. Between you, me, and the spirits, I appreciate the peace. Not just from the machines. There are many changes in Ban Ur. The hunters and shamans bicker without end. What about? How best to deal with a harsher world. The hunters, they don't want it back the way it used to be. And we shamans find ourselves able to explain less and less. So many are exiles now, sent to wander. Here, no one argues. So, I welcome mystery. <laughs> Interesting. Alright, anyway. More loot. Okay, I guess we just need to go up here then, I guess, right? So, it's so peaceful and very tranquil here. <laughs> really nice. Alright guys, let's see what's actually happening. Let's go up here. Whoa, look at that. <laughs> That's cool. This is how the Banuk must have gotten up and down the mountain. Where? Oh, okay, I see. All right, let's climb up here. Uh oh, guys, I heard glint orcs. Are they friendly glint orcs though? Friendly, yes. <laughs> Good. Okay, now what? Oh, uh, by the way, guys, there is a Banuk thing here, but I don't know how to get that. Okay, we'll do it afterwards. We'll work on it afterwards. All right, so up here, I guess. What's up here? The new cliff further north. All right. Anyway, let's go here. Okay, this is all right. This is a path to progress. So that's fine. So we just need to go here now. Okay. Now what? Oh, up here. Right. Yes. Okay. Are you still friendly? <laughs> okay. Right, here's the signal. Oh gosh, I thought I fell there, guys. <laughs> All right, here we go. All right, let's do a quick save. All right, let's go. Let's have a look. Your guard purses. You can't just leave us here. What the? Are these prisoners? Did Vilgan send you? I guess shards can buy a conscience. Never mind that. Nora girl, you have to stop me. Up ahead, we snuck up uncovered some kind of ancient device, plain as an anvil. That's what affects the machines. The other bungheads voted to take it to Pitchcliff for auction. But it's taken a beating already. Like it dropped from the sky. But we tried to stop them digging it out. Without that thing up here, those Banuk will be massacred. I'll stop them. You two get out of here. It sounds like you've already done enough damage. Well, that's a fair crazy. All right. All right, there we go. So now what? Confront the Osiram. Uh, you bunch of chuff skulls. 
The slack was on your end. I think it's okay. Looks like it's okay, doesn't it? It's only split in half. Get a whiff of that smoke. It's burned out. What the hell are these guys doing, guys? All right, let's um, speak to them. Who are you? You're not one of those Banook. <sighs> Too late. Let me look at it. Hold on, hold on. This was our delve. We did the work. You want to put your axe in? What's this thing worth to you? I don't know about this. This was your idea. You started it, you can finish. All right. Could be this thing's just scrap, but even scrap has a price. So I'll ask again, what's it worth to you? It's worth more to me than you are. You still want to negotiate? Forget it. All you've ever given me is black toes. <sighs> They've made a mess of this. But what is it? Okay, unknown artifact. Prost. Traffic malfunction. This is from long ago. And it's been sending a signal all this time. Fading out. I have to get back to the camp. Before the machines tear it apart. Alright, I don't want to interrupt the dialogue. But anyway, processor of advanced design. Severely damaged, corrupted code fragment detected, approximately 20 years old. Catastrophic malfunction, um, signal until response. I don't know what that means. It fell from the sky. What does that mean? <laughs> Guys, this, this game is so crazy. I love it. Okay, so we need to return to the Banu camp. Um, guys, I hope everything's okay down there. Oh boy, I think I know what's happened. Anyway, let's see. No, they've already started attacking. Shit, I knew it. Those freaking Osram. God damn it, guys. Okay, here we go. Right, what have we got? The machines are angered. Keep your distance. Hunters, defend the camp. Do what you must. Oh, don't move. <laughs> god damn. Oh my god, seriously? Jesus. Fear it. Right, what have we got? Oh shit, okay, I think that's a Ravager, guys. Now you'll hear my Where? Song I can't name. see it! Oh, for crying out loud, guys. Oh great, it's just totally singled me out, god damn it. <laughs> it's nice, Aloy, let's just get him. <laughs> get army. Alright, let's remove that gun. And guys, I'm gonna try something. Shit, shit. Right, I'm gonna try something. Give me a moment. Oh, God! God damn it, that guy body blocked me. Stupid arsehole. Freaking hell, man. I got jeopardized by an NPC. Okay, what I was gonna do, we need to try this again. No, get off, get off. Okay, so... Oh, that's pretty sick. Guys, that is pretty sick. Okay, who's next? Now you'll hear my song, machine. A sharp song. Oh, guys, this weapon is crazy. He's not going to be happy about this. Are you okay? Oh, he got frozen. <laughs> okay, guys. Anyway, let's um loot up real quick. Oh, that's sad, man. That shaman's going to be really broken hearted. And it's all because of those freaking um, Osiram. Oh, man, that sucks. That really sucks. All right, anyway. Right, who do I speak to? T uh, Tick Cook. Oh man, he's gonna be pissed. 
Nora, did you know this change would come upon us? Not exactly. Although I know there is a lot changing in our world. This time it was outsiders. Those Osiram thought. The Osiram do not think. They will never understand the balance between us, between man and machine. Now the blue light has gone, and we are left with many songs, but more for mourning than gratitude. So what now? Will you go back to your homeland? When we teach the young to walk on shifting ice, we say, the secret is taking one step, then the next. Perhaps one day, we will understand the machine's mysteries. I hope so. Good luck, T. Cook. Oh, guys, that sucks, man. Well, they don't seem to be taking it too hard. Let's speak to the Huntress. Um, wait, is it you? This long hunt is over. Oh. Oh, well, <laughs> she's got nothing to say to us. Um, basically, she was probably happy the machines went back to <laughs> how they were before. She really wanted to hunt them, you see. Oh, man. Anyway. All right, guys. I tell you what, just to finish up, let's try and find this. I don't know how we'd get there, though. But I'm convinced it's going through this way, as if though we were going towards where those glint hawks were. Possibly. Um, well, we'll try anyway. Let's see if there's any, I don't know, climbables here. I just hope I don't die. <laughs> Alright, let's see if we can go up here, perhaps. Huh, I can't see any climbable holes. All right, guys, i tell you what, let's go. Um, I'm going to skip ahead. So you're going to find me over there and we'll see if, see if we get lucky. There might be a pathway to the Banuke artifacts. Hey, guys. Okay, I've just gone to the top of this place again. I just saw that. Can you see that painting right dead center? I have a feeling we need to go up there, but I can't see a pathway. <laughs> I'm not sure how to do this. Okay, I'm going to continue on up here. If there's no luck, you're going to find me nearabouts there. And we'll try and get that um, collectible. Be back soon. Hey, guys. Okay, I've had no luck up there. So that didn't work out. So I came back here. This is near about to where the painting is, but check this out. I can see now there are handholds. So we're not actually too far from the camp. <laughs> this is awesome. I love these little paintings and stuff. It's really cool. All right, so let's go up here. I just wonder what the meaning is behind these uh, images. But anyway, right. So, okay, that's for us to exit. Uh, why would it be this? To go up here, that's why. <laughs> Alright, so let's keep going up. Alright, come on. Okay, 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 <laughs> good. Alright, now what? Oh, guys, sorry. Look at that. Oh, whoa, I didn't even notice this before. Look at these. That's not balloons, is it? That's cool. Anyway. Oh, gosh. I get so nervous going <laughs> too high. I feel like, um, whoa, that is so cool, guys. <laughs> I love when Aloy does that. It's brilliant. Okay, now what? All right, here we go, guys. We're getting close. Oh, my God. Would you look at that? That's a devil's thirst, isn't it? Guys, that, this game is crazy. It's insane. It's like every episode I play, I just fall in love with this game more. You know? All right. Anyway, let's... Uh, oh, we found it. Guys, check it out. It's here. Check it out. Right. Banuke Artifact Punishment. Right. Let's read that. 
Okay, so this is set two. Um, uh, tech took. Wait, isn't that guy that shaman dude? Wasn't he? No, no, that's tick took. <laughs> I don't, guys, I don't know. I don't know. Right, in my exile, I often envision your eyes wide and blue and dumbstruck as the body of Signac, our chieftain, was laid before you. The Werak saw how I looked at his mate, Illy, your mother. To them, my guilt was as plain and sharp as the crack of spring ice. As they stripped me bare and left me to die on the glacier, the warmth of life departed me. Shit. But not the bitter will to hunt, to strive, to survive, perhaps to prove I needed no one, least of all those who wronged me. I am only at peace when I paint my marks and craft these offerings to you, though they will never touch the warmth of your hands. Ah, oh, man, this sounds sad, guys. Hmm. Yeah, that's pretty sad. So basically, he's uh, leaving these out in the hopes that his child, his son, will find these eventually and I just wondered you know did he does he know about his father that's it's crazy guys anyway all right look we're gonna leave it there let's just jump down here I guess um I'm really enjoying this man this is such an amazing game it really is um I don't know we'll do maybe a hunting crowns in the next episode perhaps another tall neck Maybe a side co uh, quest. We'll see how it goes, guys. Hey, guys, it's me. I do apologize for this. Um, I actually ended the episode and I said my goodbyes, said my thank yous, uh, you know, thank you for watching, etc., etc. Ignore all that because <laughs> I just realized we've got to go back to Vilgens and I'll be in Meridian. So we need to close up the actual quest. Um, yeah, sorry for being a dumbass, but <laughs> I'll see you in Meridian, guys. Hey guys, <laughs> we're back. Okay. All right, we should be quite close. And uh, there is able-bodied adventurers. <laughs> but I'm not Outlander. Are you looking for? Wait. I know your face. <laughs> you came back. <laughs> How did we fare? Expensively. That's what I was afraid of. The Tame Machines. It's hard to explain, but there was a kind of signal that calmed them. Your men got greedy, so it's gone now. Gambling's a shoddy job, girl. I should have been a weapons dealer. That's steady work. Here, take it. The half I'd owed those hammer-handed chunks. Half? I finished the job. And what was it you said? Enough to buy a more becoming garb? What do you want? Carja silks? Ah, hoisted on my own purse strings. <laughs> all right. All right, guys. Okay, now, this time, we are now finished. <laughs> Gosh. Okay, it's all done now. So, um, I guess next episode, there's another quest here. Give me a sec. Just while you guys are here, really. Uh, what is it called? This one here. We'll do Honor the Fallen. And uh, yeah, we'll try that out next episode, guys. But like I said, I'd like to very much clear the map as much as we can. This is the one where Silence was going to crash the network. So um, we'll, we'll do that later on, guys. You know, I don't want to rush the game, honestly. All right, anyway, thank you very much for joining. I hope you enjoyed yourselves, guys. And I'll uh, catch you in the next video. Take care now.